Hey everyone, uh, in this video I'm going to show you how to time a Pontiac 400. This is a 1978 400. And the first thing you want to do is look at the where the timing should be set at. There's a little diagram in here. So the timing here is going to be at, at 18 degrees at 700 that top dead center <clears throat> so if you look here so I already went ahead and marked 18 degrees on this here and 18 should be right around here the second before last so this All right, let's start it up let's see if you can't time it well I got this time light off of eBay it was a used I think I paid nine dollars total, but I took a risk on that. I didn't know if it worked or not. So we're gonna see if it works. So the first thing you want to do is plug up, plug up your time light to the battery. And plug the other end to the number one cylinder and I think that's the number one end. It should have a number here on the manifold. Alright, so I took the air cleaner off. And see if I can't show you where. What I'm talking about. Alright, so you said number one. So that means that's cylinder number one. And it also gives you the firing order right here. Let's read that. 18436. Firing. So let's go let's go ahead and fire it up and see if we can get it timed. Oh, one other thing I forgot to add, you want to disconnect your advance off the distributor. There's a little hose going back here, so I'll disconnect that. But first we gotta warm it up. Alright, so we get gotta give it Two primers. Let it let it run for about five minutes before it warms up. We got kind of like that. warmed up and uh stick pretty close this one's a little bit down I think right now it's at 12 or 14 so let's bring it down all right uh to make this easier so you can see the uh, see the mark the hashtag hash mark there you go oh you want to go ahead and paint that you can use nail polish or anything so the 18 is the second and last little dash so that's where we want it to be at let me clean some of that paint off also, you want to unloosen your distributor. There's a little bracket on the passenger side. It's right there, the little bracket there. And then it's going to be a 916. So unloosen that and you can make adjustments. Right, so what I'm doing here is I'm going to reach back here and turn it counterclockwise a little bit. Turn it clockwise. 
right, so I, all right, so I went ahead and tightened up the distributor back up, and I used uh, two wobble extensions. These work great to get into a tight spot without a was that a swivel? A little swivel, because what they see how they're built, curved to them, and what that does is makes it wobble. It gives a little bit of a flex in it. So those work great to get into uh, those tight spots without that swivels that get jammed up. So, all right, let's start it up and see what happens. All right, so yeah, it looks like it was dead on. So now it's just putting back the air cleaner and hooking up the vacuum to the distributor. And we'll start it up and see how she runs. All right, so everything's hooked back, hooked back up, and let's start it up. So the timing came on, came out spot on. Uh, uh, car ran perfect. The idle was a little high, but I made some adjustments, and uh, overall it came out pretty good. So I'm gonna call it a night. And uh, make sure you like this video if if uh, you like watching these types of videos, and make sure you subscribe.